Hey guys, <coughs> please one two three, back with another video. And so yesterday, what we did, what I did, is I posted on um, Battle Zones the videos with those. And um, well, I've been thinking and um um so these are the ones that we had left. And so. Today I'm gonna open. Hmm, I'm gonna open the polis. I'm, I'm gonna open the Polisium deck. Okay. So I do have packs coming in the mail, and so yeah, we're gonna be opening those. Oh my God. Okay, there we go. Man, I think Chaos Galaxy cards are so cool, and I'm so excited for set three because that's there's gonna be a lot of new stuff, and then also the Sindel and Cindy Index are coming out, so that's pretty cool. Man, it looks so cool without the plastic all around it. So the Depths of Plissium. We got a Trans Sponge on the back. We got one really rare card, four rare cards, one Planet card, and thirty common cards. And so, this time I'm going to read you um, the bottom part. In the mysterious, mysterious oceans of the planet Pelissium lies the sanctuary of Atlantis. A forgotten city has been drowned for hundreds of years, now inhabited by the, the mighty Zeta rays and their lesser race, the Nano rays. The secrets of the majestic creatures have been uncovered by explorers and scientists from the planet Baro. And although they are normally, normally peaceful, if the undersea home of Zetarice is a Serb, their immense powers will be unleashed. So, his stories for all his cards are really cool. And so that's another cool thing about the Chaos Galaxy is the stories. Um, so yeah, I, I forgot what was in here. I would like to get the Aquanite, because I don't have that. I need the Aquanite and... Um, uh, I forgot what the other one was that I needed. I'm probably gonna find it out at the end of this video. Okay, so. So we got the rule book. You get a rule book in every deck. So I'm gonna get, end up with four rule books by the end of this opening. Oh, by the end of opening all these. So yeah, now I won't only have two cards in my Coliseum. I'll have way more cards. So let's start off. So we got. Cairo Cross, Thousand Eyed Fish, so our first Nano Ray, Nano Ray Elasmabon, Nano Ray Gymnorus, Smackinism, Nano Ray Nano Stinger, Double Wormhole, Point, The Sacred Reef, so that, that's a good card, Relantis, um, I don't know the power of that, so I'm going to have to read afterwards. Yes, another Weatherman. Weatherman Snowflake. So I have Weatherman Clued, and now I have Weatherman Snowflake. Double Drop, so just a normal card. Jellyfished. Nano Ray. Skitty. Sticky old I'm sorry. It's hard to pronounce that. Nano Ray Elasmavon. Here's a really rare Zeta Ray Mantelos. So it is really powerful, and these these nano rays you can see swimming around him. So obviously he is really big compared to those. Galactus Saber, Super Spot, Blood Comet, Mystical Relic Jol Golden Chalice, Bullwarder, Tentaclon Head. I think I finished the Tentaclon. Another Weatherman, Weatherman Clune, Shell Argo, Transponge, Nana Ray Skeetoeta, Nana Ray Gymnorus, the Planet Polisium, Death Tully's Man Shuraka, Shuraka, Galaxy Gift, Charge Blaster, Ropel, another Relantis, 
other side of Tentaclon, and Elite Trans Sponge. Oh, sorry, forgot one more. And Mystical Beast of the Deep. Which is a really powerful common. To a seven star common. That's just really cool. Um, but yeah, we did get some really cool stuff. Um, I guess I'm gonna have to hope to get the Aquanite from the packs I'm gonna get. Um, and also, um, probably gonna open these like sometime next week. Get them open. And yeah. So, we did get some pretty cool stuff. Obviously, now I have a lot of my, a lot of cards for my Felicium deck. Or my Felicium, um, cards. And so, yeah, um, I guess, um, this is deck review number two. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.